So I just arrived in uh, Erbil I, and I just spoke to Axel on the phone because we just found out that we sold the uh, generation story that we worked on in Burma. Um, so that feels great. This is my hotel room. It's all right. It has three windows. Uh, window number one leads into a wall with some wires. Uh, window number two, a bit better, but still no proper view. And window number three, yeah. We're going to Mosul tomorrow morning, uh, quite early, so I'll, I'll be in touch after that. So we are now in the uh, the old town of Mosul, which uh, saw the heaviest fighting, and as you can see, it's just it's ruins everywhere. Devastation is hard to describe. It's just yeah, everything's in ruins. Um, but just we're starting to see some people uh, starting up new businesses and. Uh, construction work is starting to take place so there's there's a pinch of hope which is nice to see so we are being shown around uh, the back alleys of, of old Mosul now. Uh, we've seen uh, dead Daesh soldiers, um, a bunch of, of uh, antennas, um, satellite antennas, uh, because all the television and everything was prohibited. Yeah, so it's very, it's very strong to be shown around by a, someone who survived under Daesh. Yes. waiting outside of a school in a small community uh, in the outskirts of Mosul um, to interview some teachers and, uh, and meet some of the kids who are going here and are finally uh, been able to go back to school. Um, we're not allowed to interview the teachers on the school premises so we're waiting for them to come outside but then the children are all right to, to meet inside the school. So. We'll interview the teachers and then go inside again. Trying to make some documentary pictures, which is quite hard because all the kids want to be in the frame all the time. So it's a lot of, you know, peace signs and and just posing. But uh, I'm trying to get them to ignore me a bit more uh, and find some calm moments. Uh, 
Yeah. We'll see how it works out. of the house where we stay. Uh, there's a, a storm coming. Um, today's been a, a pretty good day. We've been at one of the schools this morning. So now we're leaving Mosul behind. Uh, I'm in the car with uh, my new brother Khaluk. <laughs> He's been very kind uh, letting us stay in his house for this uh, five or four days uh, driving us everywhere. So fantastic help. Very grateful for that. In the back we have Urban and Hyatt. It's serious uh, places. <laughs> okay. Um, and we're going to Erbil and then to Basra.